Welcome to Al May. We are here to share tech knowledge with you. Let's get our journey started. Hey guys, you may want to transfer or copy C drive to new solid state drive. Today we are going to show you how to do it efficiently. Part one: Tips you need to know before transferring C drive to SSD. Part two: Detailed guides to transfer C drive to SSD. Many users want to transfer C drive to SSD because SSDs have some advantages as the boot drives over HDDs. For example, SSD has faster speed of reading and writing, which reduces the time of Windows OS boot up, and it has lower power consumption. Besides, SSD has better portability and shock persistence, which decrease the risk of losing data caused by shake and strike. Whether you want to upgrade laptop hard drive to SSD entirely, or use SSD for OS, you will need to transfer C drive to new SSD. Before transfer, here are some tips you need to know. What should we take into consideration before transferring? Here are some tips. Remember to back up system and data first, and we should back up the target desk as well if it is not a new desk. For desktops, an SSD with 60 gigabytes capacity is usually sufficient, but for laptops, we need a bigger SSD because we only have one disk bay. The most important thing is the storage space must be larger enough to store our Windows OS. The easiest way to copy C drive to new SSD is using third-party OS migration software. Alme Backupper is reliable and all-around OS and disk cloning software that allows us to clone C drive to SSD in Windows 10, 8, and 7. In addition to system clone, it also contains partition clone option to clone specific partition or volume, or disk clone to clone hard drive to SSD. Just Google Alme Backupper, download and install it. Now let's transfer our C drive to SSD with it. Insert your SSD and make sure it can be detected. Run Ami Backupper and come to its home page. Select Clone tab, then choose Disk Clone. Choose the new SSD as the target disk and click Next. Tick SSD Alignment and click Start Clone after our confirmation. In fact, we can also try to transfer C drive to SSD with Windows Building Tool by manually practice. This way is more complex than using Ami Backupper. Let's check out. Firstly, we need to shrink the C drive in disk management to fit on the smaller SSD. Secondly, we should back up the shrunken C drive. We can head to Backup and Restore. Select Create a System Image. Then shut down our computer. Install SSD, go to Repair your computer, and restore from the backup image. Make sure there is only one hard drive that we want to restore. If there are other hard drives, you should exclude them. Then we should plug all the drives back in, except for the original OS drive to check out whether the computer will boot successfully or not. Finally, get to command prompt and input this command. This command line makes Windows detect the new drive and thus enable all the features unique to these drives. Two different ways of transferring C drive to SSD. Choose the most suitable one for yourself and begin to try. Hope this video can help you out. Want to know more about Aome? Looking for more tech knowledge? Just subscribe us and leave comments. We are here to help you with any questions.